Here in the latest version of Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central, we can take a look at the latest version of Save Views. So if I head to the Customers List page, on here we have quick access to two types of Save Views. If I click the little drop down to change from All, we have System Save Views, which are actually constructed for us rather than as saved as filters. So if I click on, for example, Customer and Salesperson, you note they pop out in a new window and there's no actual filters applied. This is a constructed view that is part of the system. It's actually pulling data from two tables, the customer table, but also the salesperson table. So these are save views similar in a way to those found in the previous versions of CRM or Dynamics 365 for sales, for example. If I come back, See so there are other save views, system save views, for example, showing me the customers that are blocked and what type of blocks have been applied to them. So those are system generated. I could take each of these and filter them further, should I wish to. As well as the system save views, which you see here, I've now got the ability to save my own views. So uh, here's one I saved earlier. And if I just turn on the filter pane, we see that this is saved with a filter to balance LCY is not zero. Now, one of the new features, I can save views from scratch, but what I can also do to this existing one is I can rename this, remove it, or save as to spin off a copy and continue to make um, further sort of variants of that save view. So if I just rename this one, customers with, the, customers with balance, there we go. Creating a new one from scratch is really simple. If I just head back to the all view. So I could begin a filter here by choosing to filter column and picking my filters, or I could simply go to what data interests me. So if I select main and then either do the keyboard shortcut or just choose filter this value. got my filter ready. So this is all the customers that are served by one particular warehouse, the location code of main, and then I want to save this view, I hit the save as. So give it a title that makes sense. There we go. So I've now got quick access to my save views, my ones and the system ones can quickly switch between these to get different views of the data and any of these save views could be easily exported to Excel 